Hello guys, and welcome to episode 19 of Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy. In the last episode, we took on the first star of the Dusky Dune Galaxy, and we're going to head back and get star number two. And this is the correct galaxy this time, yes, before you ask. Okay guys, the episode, or star, is called Blasting Through the Sand. And that's the second time I pointed at it to say I don't even know. Whatevs, whatevs. And we're gonna blast through some sand. Yes. The interesting thing about this galaxy is... It, along with the Battle Rock Galaxy, is the only galaxy in the game that has seven total stars. Are the only total stars in the game that have seven total stars. Watch this, kill them all at once. Ambush! And that's why you never ambush like that, because Mario will snipe you. There we go, star bits is ours, and we fly to the next planet. Okay. Now, you could break these the normal way, but it's far easier to do this. And yes, the gravity works. This is circumnavigable the flat. So yeah, if you didn't get that, you can kill them the way I just did. You didn't understand it. Because, no. Not everyone gets things that are obvious. I understand that. So, we're going to explain some. And there's also a power mushroom underneath that one. But I didn't really feel like getting that one. We're not going to need it. Here's another five star chip one. You're going to want to go around. You're going to need to go around at least twice. If you're right, it'll only be twice. But doing it right sometimes can be challenging. Make sure you get those your first time around, and then get the treasure chest last. The treasure chest is where the star ray will eventually appear. And there it is, five star chips, and the full stars are right there. You're going to want to go towards the green arrow. It cuts off a good part of the next planet. And you get a secret area with an opportunity to get one up. So avoid the suns. They will hurt you. Needless to say, they look kind of scary. If you want to test it out for yourself, feel free. I don't recommend it. And this is similar to the one in Good Egg Galaxy. I know I never won in the one in Good Egg, but I'm pointing it out right now. collect them all, and you get three one-ups. I'm going to show you, but I'm not actually going to collect the one-ups, because I don't really feel like it, and I don't need one-ups. In this game, one-ups are mostly... Well, they're useful for this, but since all the 3D Marios, your lives don't save when you exit, getting a lot of one-ups isn't really that useful. I mean, sure... Nice to have a lot of lives while you're playing. But once you get over like 10 lives, you're really gonna lose 10 lives. Honestly. I don't think so. You're not gonna lose 10 lives. So it's really not worth it. I mean. I probably should have gotten that power mushroom. Because maybe I do need it. Uh, that's what I get for being cocky. If I die, it's because I'm an idiot and I was caught. <sighs> sigh, sigh, sigh. It's a really easy mission. Step on the thing, and this thing comes up on the other side, and the power starts right there. If you try and triple jump, you won't reach it. Don't bother trying. Believe me, if it was possible, I would have done it. Got a power star.
Yeah. Okay. Star bit count increased, and we've discovered yet another new galaxy in the garden. Look at all the new galaxies on our map right now. We have a lot of exploring to do. I mean, we haven't even collected half the total stars yet, so... Or at least half of... Half the total stars. So let's head back to Dusty Dew and get the third star. Which is called... Sunbaked Sandcastle. Rises up. Then you have to avoid the objects coming down on you, or you get crushed and die. And, of course, the annoying chains there really doesn't do much. You can shoot him with Starbits to knock him down, or try and jump up and kill him. I don't think it's worth it. magically appear at the top. There we go. I'm gonna get the hidden star first. If I don't screw up at it royally. Hidden star usually gives you more trouble than the regular star on this mission. And I'd rather get it first. So, hidden star, here we come. This one is really difficult to find, too. If you haven't found it yet, it's been four years, and this is really the first Let's Play you watched, well then, that sucks for you. But at least you found it right now, didn't you? Whatever. It's all good. Obviously, you're going to need to get a bullet bill follow you, and you're going to break the cage with the star. And there it is. Simple as that. Star is there to get. You just got to go find the way. But there's an invisibility star there, and a bunch of dry bones. I think we're going to take care, have a little fun before we get that power star. What do you guys think? I think you guys would agree. I can't really know for sure. We're only gonna try once though. If we can't we can't make it break it on the first try, then we're not gonna care. Invincibility star, and let's go kick some dry bones. No extreme. No like really crazy second common that intended there at all. I mean he's named dry bones. I can't I can't give you something to work Let's get right on up here and claim our star. You got a power star. Save the game, and we'll head right on back to Dusty Dune. Let's get some more. Let's get the actual third star now. Once again, it's called Sunbaked Sandcastle. 
And because you just saw it, let's skip this intro out. Grab this question. I mean, you just all see this. It's kind of deja vu, right? I assure you, you're not going crazy. Please don't take my lunch money. Okay, let's do it again. Same thing as last time. Nothing really interesting to speak of. Same exact concept. Five star chips. Same exact mission, actually. Sometimes that'll knock you off, which will go up a whole separate time. Luckily, it didn't. You're gonna want to backflip on this ledge if you can't land perfectly, because otherwise you'll be at the same level as the and you get hit a lot. And that's not pleasant. It's not fun. At all. And there it is, five, and we'll head right on back. And this time we're gonna get the regular star, because we already got them. Regular star is really easy to get. Coconuts, spike plant. There we go. Now there's no coconuts here to take him out, so we're gonna have to launch some coconuts from here to there. Coconut launch. Get as many as you can. I mean, you don't need that many, you only need one. But if you screw it up, you don't want it to come all the way back here. I think I have enough, even though I only really hit two. So, go shoot me this guy before he goes down again. Defeated. Okay, let's jump right in this launch star and get on out of here. And head to the final planet for this minute. Star is right in there. Let's get down here so we can collect. Star bits, collect, and then the star. get right in this pipe and we'll find our way in there. Isn't that pipe just appears out of But now there's no escape. Oh no! Oh no. This may be a real problem. Don't you think? Oh no. We're gonna get crushed. Run, Mario, run! Run! Run, you can do it! Oh no, crate! Get out of my way! I'm gonna die! Oh my god! Oh my god! Run! 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 I sound like a track coach. You gotta move! Not Tim. What would we do? that'll be it for this episode. I'll catch you guys right back here next time.